Well, here we are in the dark again. The um, print I'm working on today is a child in the mess of garbage dump. This girl uh, I photographed a number of times. She was always eager to be photographed and watching me and and, this, and she's sitting in front of a, the shack where I think it's her friend's house because she, I saw her at another home later on. The friend is down here, right? He's running up the ladder. Um, this is a complicated print, so try to stay with me while I'm talking my way through this. I'm going to have to use my notes. This is attempt number four. And um, the print received 80 seconds overall at F4 with filter number two. And then I dodged her arm, which is coming down here for 30 seconds. That's the basic beginning of the print. Then I used a mask, which is here. I used this mask and there's three different areas. The ladder, the background cloth here, and then the, um, the general everything. Three different sections of this mask I used at different exposures. So this mask number one, I gave everything, all the holes, 40 seconds. And then I gave um, this blanket area on top. So I, I dodged everything else off with a card. I just gave this off. It's not quite even here. I don't quite like that. I have to do a better job there. Uh, I gave that another 120 seconds to give that some density and then this ladder area here there's a couple of rungs coming into here that are quite white i added another 60 seconds so this gets everything gets 40 seconds with the mask then this gets an additional 120 and this gets an additional this this ladder area gets an additional 60. so that's bass number one um then this area here this striped area which is i think i still have to give it more um over here the striped area I gave an extra 70 seconds and I used a whole card. My whole card is a card that I use for, let's see if I can find it for you, it's over here. So you can use this and change the shape, so I would just use a square shape like that and give an additional 70 seconds just to this area here. I think I'm going to have to push that up to about 100 with attempt number 5. Um, then I move on <laughs> and I change the aperture on the lens of the enlarger to from f4 to f2.8 because this area in the background here, all this area here is bright white, especially the top corner. Uh, the girl is shot in shadow and there's bright sunlight on the background. So I don't want the, the viewer's eye to be pulled up into that corner, that white bright light. So I'm try I burn it down a lot just to kind of make it, um, you know, invisible a bit. So to do that, I have to move from F4 to F2.8. And then I use a card coming across here and I burn this for 100 seconds, giving the little head in the corner here only 50 seconds. So I burn this and then halfway through the burn, I block a dodge this area and continue to burn, moving the card around and just burning in this whole area. And then I give an additional, with like a bent card, I give an additional 40 seconds just to the top area. Now that's still not enough of a burn because of the, the overexposure there. So I use mask number two, which is just that one area. So it would actually, i use this. It'll actually, I just burn in the top area of the garbage where the brightest light is. Now I give that an additional 300 seconds, moving around the card, trying to blend it with this. There's a tree in here. Now I'm trying to blend it. This one I didn't do quite a good job. The one previous, I did a little bit better job. Um, so I try to blend that in there as best I can. Basically, I just want to—I want to bring that area down so it's not distracting. And I'm trying to do it without with a minimal of effort, but it requires a huge amount of ex extra exposure because of the overexposure. I, I exposed for the shadows when I did shot the shot the shot, so I would have shadow detail on my subject. But what happens is I. I ended up um, overexposing the background badly. Now to compensate for that in the darkroom, I'm, I'm doing a lot of burning. 
Um, so that 300 seconds, and that'll give the 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 total uh, exposure here for the background. Just moving around that card mass number three, burning all that in. Now that all that makes sense, a lot of talking, but basically what I'm, I'm trying to do is focus my my story here and the little boy coming up. I don't want to pulled away into different areas. I want people to look around and see the general living conditions of a poor child, but I don't want to um, have these bright spotlights that are distracting and pulling you away. Now, my friend Larry suggested that I try to try to accentuate what, what is positive in film, which is grain and sometimes having overexposed areas. So I didn't do everything. See, these areas here I didn't burn in. Um, I just you know, those are bright highlights, but I, they're sort of near the subject, and even this ladder kind of leading is a little bit brighter, kind of leading into the subject is fine. I just didn't want it on the edges, and that's where I did most of my um, burning. My, my printing is adapting over time, and I think I'm becoming a better printer, but it's a long, involved process. I don't know how many steps. Look at all these steps here. I mean, I have a whole sheet full of stuff here. And it received... Um, it received... Four minutes of development in Dectol one to one. The paper is Ilford Warm Tone, which is the brown box here. The Ilford Warm Tone paper. Um, I think that's all I have to say on this. I'll continue working on it, and hopefully, within the next two or three tries, I can get something that's good enough for the show. I'm looking at this area here. It's a little bit. I'm gonna have to burn this down a bit too. And her. I don't know why, but her top is a little different from one shot to the other. See, it's darker here. I must have done a bit of burn the first time. And here it's a little bit lighter. Ah, <sighs> trials and tribulations of printing. Well, anyway, thanks for coming to the site, and thanks for sharing my little moment here. Talk to you later.